Today, I'll talk about the design equation of steady state plug flow reactor. So, in a plug flow reactor, the composition of the fluid varies from point to point along with the flow path. Now, here is the plug flow reactor, and reactant is flowing through a plug flow reactor, and uh, here that composition of the reactant will vary from point to point along a flow path. So now here consequently the material balance for a reaction component must be made for a differential element of the volume dv so now here i am taking one differential volume dv and across this different volume different differential volume i'll do the mass balance so here is the mass balance equation so input is equal to output plus dis disappearance by reaction plus accumulation so now here are the assumption of PFR. So first is no accumulation. At steady state, the accumulation term is zero. Uniform flow, no radial gradients in velocity or concentration. Properties varies only along the length. Then constant density, often assumed, particularly if the reaction doesn't involve significant changes in molar volume or if the fluid is incompressible. No back mixing. Each fluid element moves through the reactor at the same velocity, maintaining its identity. Now, we already know the mass balance equation. Input of mass is equal to output of mass plus disappearance by reaction plus accumulation. Now, uh, as we are taking the differential control volume, so now in across this control volume, we have to do the mass balance. So differential balance consideration, so input of A that is FA, mole parts time, output of A that is FA plus DFA and disappearance by reaction and we know as it is a steady state, so accumulation is actually zero. So now if we put together, so balance equation uh, derived from the differential analysis, so we will get the uh, balance equation, so here zero, okay and uh, that input minus output so here input minus output minus disappearance by the reaction so here 0 is equal to fa that is input minus output this is input this is output minus that disappearance by the reaction so here that output is fa plus dfa disappearance by the reaction minus r into dv now if we reorganize so first, uh, okay, first DFA, DFA is nothing but D of FA. So FA is nothing but FA0. So this is FA0. Okay, so DFA, FA0, 1 minus XA. Now if I do the differential, so FA0 will come out and minus DXA. Now substituting in the balance equation, 0 is equal to minus DFA minus of minus RA into DV. So DFA is nothing but ra into dv and we got that so here uh, that is something uh, f minus fa0 dx so dfa is fa0 dx so minus will come so here uh, that will come here so that is nothing but minus ra into dv so you can write here so minus fa0 fa0 then dx so this minus will go here okay and that will be fa0 dx is equal to minus r into dv simplifying further so dx by dv is equal to minus r in r by fa0 minus r by fa0 dx by dv so that is the design equation for plug flow reactor now here the differential x section of the reactor with volume dv follows so if we do the integration so 0 to v dv by fa0 is equal to 0 to xa dxa minus ra so fa0 is feed rate constant across the reactor ra is the rate of reaction varies with concentration of the converse cell so now we got this equation now here if we do that integration so v by fa0 is equal to tau by ca0 that is equal to 0 to xa 1 by minus ra dxa okay so here tau is the pace time so tau is nothing but v by v0 is equal to vca0 by fa0 so integrating account for the variable rate in plug flow versus constant rate 
in mixed flow or in, in mixed flow so this is the design equation for pfr that's it thank you